hi this is Fee and uh, welcome to my channel I would like to be give a big shout out uh, to everybody that has subscribed to my channel uh, it is the 22nd of February and I have hit 303 subscribers so um, that's quite remarkable quite remarkable very very surprising for me um, considering I didn't think I'd get even a hundred <laughs> so yeah thank you for uh, subscribing I really appreciate it and um, yeah stay tuned for more but what I'd like to show you is uh, the leopard now this is a 30 by 40 um, I've done a time-lapse of this full the full pro full, full um, doing the diamond painting and I did it basically um, almost one row at a time uh, using tweezers the whole time and it took about uh, 24 to 30 hours to complete oh pardon me and 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 from this a section about this big was generally about two hours um, two hours if I didn't have interruptions um, but you know life gets in the way <laughs> so you have to deal with that every now and then but so this I purchased from Malaga markets it is also available on Aliexpress and if you actually go back and look at my unboxing of this one you'll see all the details on that when I brought this I brought this because I wanted something I wanted to go and check out a local place that I could buy them which is less than a five minute only a five to ten minute drive from where I live the way it came gave me was fantastic because not whoops that's some washi tape on there not a single single fold crease roll ripple this was in a bag fully stretched out fully open had, looked like it hadn't been rolled it was fantastic which then gave the quality of um, drilling quite um, nice to do no rivers nothing so with that I haven't even got a slight bit of a fold anywhere so he's, he's actually quite gorgeous so I purchased this ooh, back in the early days of diamond painting and uh, when I was waiting for China Mail as well so it was like well I've got this here so that I can the ones I'm doing I, the ones I had if I got them done I was able to I had something there while I was waiting for more China Mail and that's where I learnt my lesson to make sure that um, I always had diamond paintings I'm almost at the stage where I need to start ordering more China mail okay so this is him I'm going to 30 by 40 I can't even remember how much I paid for it although I think it's in the um, the diamond painting that I um, when I did the unboxing or unpacking but what I'm going to do now is do the de-kitting and then I will go through and uh, talk about how much drills I've got left. I will say I had some drills where they were hollowed out so basically they had the curve all the way in and wouldn't stick. Um, so there was, there was actually quite a lot of um, bad drills. I didn't keep them, I was going to, but I didn't end up keeping them. Um, and still had quite a, quite a good amount of uh, drills left over. So uh, time lapse coming up and uh, I'll talk to you once this has been de-kitted.
Okay, so I've got through some of my de-kitting and I've actually gone, oh my goodness. One of the things I did when I first started was I did my labels. My normal labels with the Xyron. Is it going to focus? No, it's not going to focus. Okay, hang on. Okay, but then I all what I also did is I used my Dymo label maker as well because I had the plan to. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Um, I had the plan to keep my leftover drills in these containers. So, that being said, I've since discovered how many leftover drills I have. So, I don't do this process, but I have two lots of labels anymore. So, they, it's really quick to remove just the paper labels. So, these ones, I'm not going to clean out here. I'm going to go let them soak. And, um, otherwise, it's going to take me more than an hour to clear these up. On that note, so they're going to go in a bucket and soak in water. On that note, I would also like to show some symbols that I struggled with. Now, I struggled with the, um, when you see the time lapse, excuse me, last night was very late. <laughs> Stay up, stayed up just to get this done. When I, when you look at the time lapse, you'll see me with this thing, my micro, my magnifying glass. Um, come out that's because I had some symbols that were so hard they were mixed up together um, they, were, they were just very hard to read one of them I can actually show here the other the one lot I can actually show here um, and they were When it comes up, nope, it's not going to come up. Or will it come up now? Okay, five and six. Doesn't look much of a difference there, but I tell you what, when you're diamond painting, it did. Another one that I had issues with, I had issues with one, two, and Y. Now one, I think I've already wiped the label off. One and Y, um, just move more. So if you look at, sorry, just trying to find it. Okay, so if you look at Y, Oh gosh, just trying to focus on the other words. Now it's, I think it's, it's focusing on my shiny nails. Um, anyway, one, two, and Y were very hard to distinguish. So that was another one that I struggle with. And something else they did, which is so frustrating so frustrating is actually white white symbols on light colors so focus two and one were hard there's the Y if you see the one and the Y when the symbols are a little bit blurry and close together and you're tired they were very hard to see then if we turn it over you see the five and the six yet again and the V is light colored I can understand doing light colored symbols on a dark like the W and like the plus but light colored single symbols white symbols underneath light colors they're just it's just excuse me but it's just stupid um, I use a light pad and then had to use a, micro, a magnifying glass, the same microscope. So that was that side of it. Symbols were clear, but they were not um, easy to read. So there's another issue I had with this. 
So this actually came from, oh, actually, there we go, Malaga Markets. I paid $35. There was instant gratification. And I think for diamond painting, when you've got no diamond paintings, instant gratification is worth it. Now, drills. I had every one I had left over drills. I did have some that were, I thought were getting pretty close. Hang on, let's see if I can zoom you. Just gonna zoom you. Sorry about this. That's probably easier to see. Okay, so 646 was very low and nine, Seven, five. So I did have a couple where I was like going, oh, getting close. Um, and considering the 646 was actually one of my main colours. So that's, with a main colour, you'd, you'd expect a main colour to run out, to, to have about that much left over or, or you know, big amounts left over. But as a main colour that is cutting it really close now for those that are seeing that i did two piles there's a reason for the two piles and i will actually go a little bit into it because i've started splitting these up this here on my right bring these down are for a project so these will go into my storage containers into my leftover drills but I have a project and this guy is my project this um, so you see where I think it's heaven and earth designs they they do this for you um, where you can get your diamond pattern done up exactly as if it's a cross stitch so what I have done is I've actually found a website where I can convert my own this guy here he's big he's going to be 115 centimeters wide and 64 and three quarter high so see how this has actually got the different sizes it tells you all your different sizes and see that little bit there 120 DMC colors whippy it's quite big so what you get when you do this and when I do the project when I really start to work on the project I will show you um, bit more I'll give you details of where I get this pattern from this pattern only cost me nine dollars ninety five US but when you look at so I you get to choose you can get it to work your size you can pick how many dime well not you can pick a range of how many uh, different deep diamonds different um, colors you go with you know you can get it to 90 you can really really exceed it hugely um, you will see there 367 dark pistachio green I need one um, hang on where we are we okay right no hang on I'm just trying to find a good example 645646 of uh seven seven nine nine two uh, okay nine three four there's no good examples nine four five yes there is okay so what I can show you is so nine nine four five that I've got here of my own leftover drills and 945 of tawny I only need 15 so I don't I'm not going to need to order one bag of 945 
So I'm going through all my leftover drills and making sure that I have enough colours where I, you know, a lot of my colours where I don't have to order. And for those that see like 154, that's in a large amount, huge amount of diamond paintings I've done. But for the first three, four, I actually don't need five, no, no, four. For the first four, five, six, seven, I don't need to order any bags for those colours. So there's quite a few colours in here that I don't need to order for. Um, so yeah, watch this space because this is a big one. In here, it has your index sheet. There is two ways, two choices. Well, you've got a choice of how these come. You, could, you get it as a PDF that you can access on the website. This is actually 90 pages. Take off six for the instructions. So nine, 84 pages. And you can get it as a large, which is why there's so many pages or you can have it done as just a small where it's going only 34 pages okay what i did do is that's the big one that'll help me read or i can do the small one which is the exact size of the diamond of the the drills so there's a couple of ways i can do this but yeah so that's why you saw me separating and um, only those that have watched this through to the end will through to the end of this will actually see that this is my next project and I have decided that when I hit the 500 subscriber mark I will do a giveaway but the giveaway I will actually announce i'll put a do something i don't know what it is i'll do something and it'll, it'll turn around and say there's a special project what is it or yeah just a, the question of what is a special project um and i'll look for an answer I'll, I'll go for whoever answers um in that without actually having to look through um, so yeah so that's that's the big project that i've got coming up which is going to take me a while especially when it's one page at a time but I like the big diamond paintings and I like a challenge um, so yeah but all in all go back to this this dude here when I first unboxed it unpackaged it I went oh it's a lot of money to pay for a diamond painting Especially when you can get your freight free and it was only like $14, $15 from AliExpress. However, I will say this. This is, canvas has not been rolled. It has not been folded. There's no creases. And that in itself makes the process of diamond painting so much easier. And of course the other is gratification instant gratification um so these guys do have a range it wasn't a big range but they do have a range of these so um i will probably drop into them and see them and um i might be able to see them and get the drills for my project um somewhere else from them without having to order them online but that's a big task in itself so Big thumbs up to these guys, to Malaga Markets, instant gratification and flat canvas. Um, beautiful work with some of the sim symbols were not good uh, and some of the drills were not good, but that's not Malaga Markets' fault. That is issue is with the company that made it, um, which under the washi tape, you can actually see it's the... Nike store um, H1091 if you type in H1091 into AliExpress it will take you straight to this 
straight to this picture so yeah thank you for watching please thumbs up thumbs down make a comment um subscribe and hit the bell and yeah thank you to all my subscribers and thank you to those that watch all the way through to the end and one little thing i have had my nails updated and i've managed to get some rhinestones on them there we go i will admit though one of them is out of place let's have a look at there we go it's not going to focus on them but yeah there's some rhinestones on the two fingers or both on the outside so yet again um anyone in perth that's l tone shopping center as i get these done so i'll thank you very much and i'll talk to you later and enjoy my time lapse okay bye